this is my mom's ano eh, mm -hmm. um, philosophy. Live within your means. However, you should also enjoy the fruits of your labor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's like a diet, di ba? Yeah. If, if you're always under diet na you feel deprived, yeah. you will not be able to sustain that. So in the same way with saving, mm -hmm. you should be able to sustain it by having fun naman. Mm -hmm. You treat naman yourself yes. once in a while. Like um, like with the boys, I mean, they said they, they have really invested and all that. Is there something that they wanted na, oh, I really want to buy maybe, I don't know, a car or depends on their, I don't know eh, in their, their age, they bought, or they want to buy this certain computer. So were they able to get money from that, from their savings, and buy what they want? Well, there was a, there's a story about our youngest. Um, yeah. Because he has a desktop, he had a desktop at home which was mm -hmm. conking out already, and he wanted a laptop. Mm -hmm. So he said that he was going to save for a laptop. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Kaya lang sa katagalan, he changed na rin his mind. So. That's another thing, you know, it's like the marshmallow test. If you mm -hmm. delay your gratification, later on you will say na, okay, I don't really need I it. I don't really need it. And then he got himself a hand-me-down laptop. So mm. he wasn't, he didn't have to withdraw anymore from his investment. Okay, and also, I guess, no, I mean, they're on that age, I guess that when they're dating already, they don't ask money enough from you for the dating. Kasi <laughs> they have na, <laughs> they mag -ipon sila. Dapat mag na sila. Yeah, yeah, they get from it from their, their allowance. allowance. Even the load. Even their cell phone load. The cell phone load is taken out of the allowance. Yeah. So they, they just get it from there. So. Yeah, I see. Okay, um, so Mar Marvin, you have this thing in your company, which is BDO. Mm -hmm. Um. Um, the easy investment plan. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit more about this? I yeah. mean, I'm sure this is also um, something that the boys use you know, to mm -hmm, be mm -hmm, able to mm -hmm. save, right? Yes, yes. Oh, this is kind of a unique investment or unique product because uh, only a few banks or even ourselves show this. No? This is the video investment, uh, EIP, quality easy investment plan. It is your easiest way to save. Mm -hmm. uh, once you save, you have to invest it. Eh. Uh, what we do is that we, you just have to open an account with BDO and it helps you uh, save automatically. Meaning, uh, what does it do? It cures your spending uh, epidemic and fights obstacles to financial freedom. Meaning, when you automatically invest, automatically debit your account, it goes to a certain you call it UITF for investment yeah. on a monthly basis, on a consistently and automatic basis. And basically. then this is not, this cannot be withdrawn. And you can withdraw it anytime. Actually, you can withdraw it anytime. Uh, except that, sign naman eh, it's a, it's a program that you want to do for a long period of time mm -hmm. so that you will be able to, to get the fruits of its uh, mm -hmm. uh, program. No? And uh, what is nice about it is that it is automatically invested. Okay. Uh, but in you a you fund, a fund. Uh, in a fund of your choice, whether it's a fixed income fund, a balanced fund, or an equity fund. Uh, how different is this from stocks? From uh, it, the, the difference is that the in stocks, you specifically invest in a certain stock. This one is automatically invested in a fund. Mm -hmm. The fund invests in stocks. So yes. it is a fund manager that handles it. Like myself, I manage the fund, yeah. and then uh, it is invested in different stocks. Uh, the choice of the fund depends on your risk risk appetite. Yes, you can yes. be conservative, which is what you call the fixed income fund. Yeah. <coughs> you can be a little bit balanced. We mm. call it the balance fund, or a little bit more aggressive, or the equity fund. What about um, what about minimums? Baka it might be high, no? Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, what we designed it to be is only very small minimum, like mm. one thousand pesos a month. But it has to be on a regular basis. Can it be one thousand now? Three months after, I'll put another thousand, and then mm -hmm. six months after, talagang <coughs> dapat uh, <coughs> fixed on a regular basis. Yeah, it has to be regular. It has to be fixed, but you can change it later on, but not very, but not mm -mm. too often. Mm -mm. Uh, it it it's better because it's just one one mm -hmm. amount on a monthly basis, so Thank that you will have be be able to plan and budget your funds uh, more organized. I see. Maybe we can talk more about that yeah, in yeah. another episode. Yes, no? yes, All uh -oh. the funds that we can um, ask our viewers to, to, uh, choose to choose from and what are the different products that BDO can help our viewers save. 
Yes, but, but for the wealth. viewers now who want to go, they can just approach any branch of BDO mm -hmm. and ask about the EIP, the EC EIP. Investment Plan. Okay. And then the branch people can tell them All about over the Philippines? It. Yes, it's I nationwide. Um, the book, Raising Pinoy Boys, yeah. before we end our segment. <laughs> okay. um, tell us about your book. I okay. mean, what made you think of um, writing, putting a a book. writing a book? It's my midlife crisis <laughs> project. Well, anyway, no, it's a midlife assessment. You there. come to an age. There. Yeah. yeah, that's the book. Yeah. Um, when you try to question yourself, um, am I doing what am I, am, what I'm supposed to be doing right now? And especially that all my three sons are already grown up. Mm -mm. So I, I thought of coming up with something, and it's a compilation of all the things of, mm -hmm. of my t over two decades of parenting. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And um, there it is. It's it's about raising Pinoy boys. And aside from my own experiences, I was able to interview the parents of um, successful Pinoy men, such as uh, the parents Christine. of Lance Gokongwei, mm -hmm. uh, Tony Meloto, Jolly Bee Tony Tan Kakyong. Here, we have Chris Chu on the screen a while ago. And mm -hmm. then um, the president of BDO, are, they are also three boys, eh, and all mm -hmm. of them are very successful. President of BDO, president of oh, RCBC. Okay. And uh, there's Lance, Lance Gokongwei, Lance, yeah. and of course, uh, yeah, as I mentioned, Chris Tew. Oh, uh, and then, and, then, and you, how is the reception book? I mean, yeah, Marvin um, said it's what? It's a <laughs> bestseller. <Yeah. laughs> lapit na, lapit na. Uh -oh, uh -oh. And in fact, um, we are also coming up with an ebook mm -hmm. edition for mm -hmm. this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it can be sold, it will be sold through Amazon mm -hmm. and Apple Store. Mm -hmm. So right now it's available fully booked. A national uh, books. books and national bookstore. Ah, okay, the major bookstores. Yes, and also they're also available in some boys' schools, ano? Mm -hmm. And there's an arrangement that, uh, for example, in Ateneo, Xavier, LaSalle, mm -hmm. and Southridge, for every book purchased, there's a 100 peso donation given to the school. Okay, question. Mm -hmm. Is this just for mothers or parents to re to um to read na with boys lang paano yung kung girls lang well i have a lot <laughs> of um friends and even anonymous readers who uh -oh. have given me feedback that they were able to apply a lot of the insights that they got from the book with uh -huh. their daughters mm -hmm. so and one of the favorites actually there is chapter 6 on mm -mm. money matters mm -mm. which oh. is our topic right now <laughs> i see so that's good so viewers um if you have time, you know, can read this, Racing Pinoy Boys by Rose Fausto. Yes. And um, it's a very good read, especially now, like our topic is Racing Saver. So it's really good that we start um, our, very young. Uh, our <laughs> kids very young yes. to save because um, that's going to be a good foundation of an e a good economy. Yes, really that's right. Saving. That's right really. So we have to take a break. Um, uh -huh. Last a few words before we take her because later we will ask the boys to come in oh yeah no. yeah you will see the the fruits of our labor yeah so <laughs> well um, actually i'd like to invite them not just to buy but to also register with the website it's mm -hmm. um www.racingpinoyboys.com mm -hmm. yeah. yeah i also just like to say that what what my wife said no like on for my in a month is not really how much you earn yeah they must remember it's not how much you earn but how, how much, much you save, save. That that's counts. true I think that's, that's what we want to tell our viewers. Yes, that's true. So it's not how much you earn, really. It's not how yeah. it's how much you save, because um, the fruit of o the core of all our work and doing business is really to create wealth by saving, right? Yes. So we'll um, have to take a break, and um, we'll see you in a few minutes, and we'll ask the boys to come in. <laughs> Good morning once again. You are watching the Business Portal and our segment is Investment Academy. I am your host, Rowena Suarez, and you can just call me Ro. Um, today we're talking about, our topic today is Raising Savers. Um, earlier, we've already interviewed the parents of these two handsome boys um, regarding how they raise them, how to save. No, um, in a li uh, just uh, we, we will be interviewing them in a little bit. But now for our portion, making sense with money sense. As the saying goes, the journey to making millions begins with a single cent. 
So from Money Sense Magazine, um, there's uh, this uh, uh, article by Stuart Fisher, Five Tips to Making Saving Fun for Kids. Okay, first, take your child to the bank to open an account. Because, you know, they feel kind of like an adult when they go to the bank and save. Diba? And um, and then number two, let your child understand the money is still theirs and will be used to buy larger purchase in future sets iPads, CDs, skateboards, etc. Whatever whatever they want to purchase. No, because parang it's so grueling naman for them to always save, save, save. Tapos they don't naman see anything. Na parang walang parang walang consuelo after a while. So that's that's one thing. And number three, if you have more than one child. I don't know if this will work for everybody. It's actually kind of good to set up a challenge that who can save more to reach their goals. And number four, have a goal and visualize. Um, let's say um, your child really wants that bike, that bicycle. Um, you tell them to save, you know, save for it and maybe have a picture and picture that bike and put it in their um, bedside so whenever before they sleep and they wake up, they can see it and they can visualize, oh, I'm saving for this, I'm saving for this. And number five, um, um, encourage them to have a coin bank. You know, you maybe let's say a 10 peso allowance, 5 pesos you save, 5 pesos you spend. So it's also actually the discipline of making them save. And for our finance news, um, we need to, ma uh, for our finance news slide, um, 2012 budget nearly ready. The, tw the 2012 national budget could be finalized next week as a development budget. Coordination Committee DBCC meets to evaluate a draft outlay and its attendant macroeconomic assumptions. Um, SSS benefit disbursements for Luzon members rise to 12%. Benefit payments disbursed by the Social Security System SSS to its Luzon members rose to 12.5% in the first three months of the year. Lastly, the peso closes flat with no clues to lead market. The peso large barely moved against the dollar yesterday due to the lack of market leads and that is business to business news from business world for our finance watch the stock market opened at 4299.79 it went on a high of 4299.79 a low of 4258.90 and it closed at 4258.90 for the peso dollar rate we opened at 43 43.120, a high of 43.120. It went on a low of 43.210 and closed at 43.210. And that's all from Business World. So, um, boys, so Martin and Enrique, and you are the kuya you said of everybody. Yeah. And um, you're still in school. Yes, um, I'm currently taking up business management in Ateneo, mm -hmm. Manila, and I'm on my senior year, so one more year before I start working and entering the workforce. <laughs> and do you already know what you want to take up? I'm sure like this, yeah, you already I, I know. I sort of have a grasp on what I want to do, but there's no exact saying like what I'm going to be when I grow up. So Let me take a wild guess. <laughs> you want to be in finance too. Or not banking? Not really, <laughs> but I want to be familiar with it. But not, yeah. not, it's not my career path as of now. And Enrique, you're just you're going to uh, incoming first year incoming also first in year. Ateneo. My course is uh, BS Management Engineering. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And in terms of career, it's still um, I don't exactly have an ex uh, a specific career choice that I want. So you your parents earlier said that. Ever since you were young, you uh, were already saving. Mm -hmm. Was it hard for you, like when you already started getting your baon? Did your parents tell you, okay, you don't say you don't spend everything, you save a portion of it? Was it hard for you guys to do that? Uh, not really. Me no. Because um, my first allowance was back when I was in grade one. It okay. was a uh, hundred pesos per week. Mm. And no, that's then a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> per week, per, per week, week, per week. And then they told us that. It was it wasn't exactly like a forced upon rule, but mm -hmm. then it was like a a guideline that there's supposed to be twenty percent saved. And then since we already had our own ban na food, yeah. So it wasn't that hard. It's just yeah. for the extra French fries or whatever snacks you want. Yeah. So Actually they didn't really impose it on us. Yeah, um, not really. 
they showed us how... You're not saying that's because your mom and dad's watching, huh? Because when they were asking that question, I never really remembered any negative feeling in saving. I mean, we had had our own boxes, our treasure chests Mm -hmm. before, and then we had our notebooks. And each week, um, our mom would ask us, okay, so how...